five things off the wall. That's us, man. 24-7. You should expect the unexpected. I mean... Make it known that this is all about being 100% authentic. We are live now. So, with that being said, let's jump right in. Can we talk about this whole Howard situation? Before, I, before I, we jump I, yeah. What happened at Howard? So, apparently, this white student is suing Howard Law School for $2 million. <clears throat> Give him his title, the most hated <clears throat> in the no, history well, of all look, the Howard. Well, I was going to get to that. Get to that. <clears throat> me, but he's, he's suing for $2 million because he feels that he was racially discriminated yeah. against. And he said he wasn't supported by the institution, right? And he wasn't supported by the institution. And he said the stem the reports say that it stemmed from a tweet or something that they found on social media that could have been racially insensitive, and that that's when things started to happen negatively for him. He also reports also states that the <laughs> international director of law, I believe, at Howard University. That title may be wrong, but if something like that said that he was, what is it, Walt? The worst? The worst or the most hated student. The student most hated student that he's, that he's ever, ever yeah, experienced in all that. that he's he's ever experienced in existence. In existence of Howard University. Howard right. University Law School. Now, what makes this... Wait, can you, wait, stop right there right quick. Yeah. So when, for that, is he saying that for he, this is a student that He's never hated a student more, or is he saying that everybody? No, 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 no. no. He, what he, from what it sounds like, from how I read it, he was telling him this, right? And it wasn't, it wasn't singled out. It was all these people hate you okay. for what you've done. At least that's how I read it. Right? That's how I understood it. Now, what makes this story so crazy is that. First of all, that this white guy is suing Howard, Howard Law School for mm -hmm. two, who, make, who makes it hit home for everybody that is a host on the show is because the person who apparently said what they said about him being the most hated person is somebody that we all know, except Walt, who claims yeah. he doesn't know this man. But um, I'm, I'm um, I, know him. I, I know him. Yeah. Yeah. Did he go to San Juan He did. Yeah. He did. So it's your frat brother, Walt. Right there. Yes, it is, yeah. it, is, it, is, uh -huh. it is our brother, Derek's frat brother, his chapter brother. Mm. Okay, uh, let me see who this is. Uh, that, and and it is uh, and because his name is in reports, is uh, Reggie. His official his official. Oh, all oh, right, because that's right, he worked there. Okay, yeah. His official yeah, right. title is the global head of diversity there you go. recruiting. The global head of diversity. There you go. He Thank allegedly you. told Newman that he had become the most hated <laughs> student McGee had seen. <laughs> during his tenure at the university right, right right so 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 for those who are listening when i saw this article because i have a because i have a brother who was in the same chapter as the person who was in this report <laughs> I say, listen i say look man we we need answers right we need we need to know what's going on what type of inside information does our brother drick willie know yeah, about what's going on here yeah, so, yeah. So, what's, so, what's up? And let the people know what's going on. Yeah, so you know, I don't know exactly. You know, I wasn't there, right? <laughs> oh, but, God. but, 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 what I will say is that you know, <laughs> like, out of all the years that that I I've known Reggie, oh. and every and everybody that I knows know Reggie says, says that we know you know Wolf. Anyway, go ahead. Yeah, this okay. it's 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 not in his character to say something like that. And first and second of all. Like he's in law, like he's been in law for years. For years. So you would think somebody, you know, that accomplished in the area of law would know what to say and what not to say um, that would keep him out of trouble. Right. And so. Right, right, right. Let me, well, hold on, hold on. Before you ask that, let me ask you this. Now, do you think it was one of those things where it was behind a closed door? meeting right and he could have said well yo man like 
the things you've that you become, said makes you the most hated person hated. right now. Could it be? Could it? Could it have been that? Yeah, I mean, it, I it probably could have. It probably could. Think it was wordplay. That way, yeah. That way, yeah. you're not. I'm not. I'm not saying that. You know, I hate you, right? I'm. I'm just making it known that this is how people feel about you right now. And in that case, how do you bring a lawsuit against me? Mm -hmm. Um. So what was the point of him saying that to the kid, though? Now, now, here's the thing, right? Now, it doesn't say that the lawsuit is against, at least how I read it. And I, you know, I could be wrong. Mm -hmm. well, he's bringing it against the, the university, but he's using had, those you know, words. He's using, yeah, he's yeah. using. But what was the point of he's using that? These... But the reports are saying <laughs> that. Like, the reports are adding it into the entire story as if, you know, they, they, they want to <laughs> frame a narrative. It does because mm -hmm. all right, so when you use those words and you use that point, it supports what this kid is saying. Everybody right. hates right. me, right? Mm -hmm. And I didn't do anything wrong. Mm -hmm. And the university won't support me. They know everybody hates me, and look, they still didn't do anything. So even if he said it in a closed door session, or even if, which is what I think it might have been more, of uh, it was a uh, wordplay and contextually, it's being perverted. To benefit that kid, mm -hmm. you know he. Might and so why are the, why is he saying that everybody hates him though? Like before that, because why was he it was saying something that? About why is he being right. racially? Can you, well, can you pull up what the um apparently what was allegedly said by the he, person? He he. It was was it so much what he said? It was like it was it, it was, was a tweet. Split, it, was it was tweets. Tweet. He had yeah. tweeted out some um insensitive stuff, kind of mm. um trying to. He said. Uh, it was after a police brutality situation. He said, mm -hmm. "What basically what happened before that?" Right. Um, to 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 kind of make it seem like yeah, the kid got beat or whatever. Deserved it, right? What happened before that? What did he do? What did you do to right. me? Mm -hmm. Ah, he, right. Uh, okay. It was something about the the slave, the 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 slave who was abused, and it was the same thing. Like, well, what did he do to get that? Right, that. because because of, because a photo that they showed and Chris, you, you Chris and, and and Derek, you may have seen this photo before. It was it was of a slave who had these shredded up back. He had these um, hideous yeah. scars mm -hmm. on nope. his back that were healed mm -hmm. from all the whippings that 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 he was taking. Mm -hmm. So 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 the to, the kid asked in the Twitter feed, "Well, what happened before that for him to to get that? Like, what did what did he do?" In what did he do to deserve that? Bars. What did he do to deserve that? Right. right. Mm -hmm. And so he doesn't think people should have a problem with him because of that? <laughs> he said he, he said was it. there to learn there more about he was there the, to learn more. the culture right. of uh, minorities. Um, right. and so to, you asked that kind of question? Not to, he, he wasn't, he wasn't being malicious. He right. said he, he did it to, to, to learn and understand. Did, did he, did he crawl from under a rock? Right. Yeah, I, I, I don't, I don't know, and this is what Devin and I like. We had a so yeah, go go ahead. So talk about the conversation that you were like. So Devin and I had a conversation yeah. about it, right? And do we think that there was a little bit of trolling in an effort to instigate people to say this? Possibly, Dev. I think you said like maybe his thought process was, "I'm gonna instigate an issue just to kind of sue the school." You know what I'm saying? Like this was all. Mm -hmm. Well, well, let me say this. I, I, what I said was, <laughs> what I said was that I can definitely see him getting some money from the school for this. Right. Oh yeah. They, you know, um, people settle. I, people settle every day, B. Right. Right. I, this, this, that's what I said. As soon as, soon as you put it, here's the thing. When you say anything harassment, yeah, it's, it's hard to get. It's hard to get. It's hard to overcome it. Settlement. Because harassment is such a vague term. Yeah. So. Will well, he I get? Definitely will he get and, I, and I said that, and I said that I wouldn't be surprised if he was to settle or, or or come out with some type of win that conservatives could potentially make him a poster child. I wouldn't be surprised right. if that happened. I wouldn't be surprised if Fox News went ahead and, and interviewed him and you, you know wanted to talk mm -hmm. about all the pain and strife and grief and that he's been going through because of this and and how he's been wronged. Like, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, him. listen, if I was his lawyer, that's the campaign I would put him on. I would take him right. on, right? Of course. So I mean, that's that's what they have to do. But here's the, here's the here's my um my question. All right. 
Two million dollars is a lot of money. Do I think he's going to get two million? No. Do I think he might get like a quarter million, anywhere up to maybe three quarters of a million? Possibly. It depends on how bad um, they want to settle the suit. I don't think he'll see a million. And I think after it's all said and done, maybe the total award might get up around five hundred, seven hundred fifty thousand, um, and that'll include like his lawyers' fees. I think it might be easier for Howard just to say, "Listen, we're going to settle to not have to fight it." Now, could they fight it and win? I think so. Um, I think yeah, it just there's turns. no evidence. Well, that's the, but like Dev said, this is also relative. I was harassed. Are you going to put? If Reggie, if Reggie did say that, let's just say Reggie said that, or he said some version of that, right? Yeah. Even if he said it in the most politically correct way possible, but he said some version of that, he's going to know how that's going to sound in a court of law. And it doesn't matter what his intent is. Mm -hmm. His intent is not going to matter as much as how it sounds. Mm -hmm. So I, I could see them. Yeah, how it sounds and how it was perceived. Right. Right, 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 and how it could, how easily it could be perceived as such a negative thing. Mm -hmm. So, we all, you know, know him, and what I remember of that brother, he was, he was very, 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 very genuine, very kind, very, um, not malicious in any way, from what I remember of him, and that was, you know, a while back. But, and 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 intelligent, so he's smart enough to know. If this goes and sits down and we got to get, you know, there's going to be a transcript. And when that gets read out, it's not going to sound the way people read it because people read in the emotion that they're experiencing. Mm -hmm. So yeah. they don't read that with, oh, yep, mm -hmm, Howard knew. Look, <laughs> the, the diversity guy, the diversity guy, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. You know? Yeah. Even though. Yeah. So I, wait, wait, hold up a second. Devin, was that your airpod case you were just holding oh my god we are not gonna <laughs> keep doing this oh my god no my bad brother my bad my bad so, i don't want to kick a brother with that have you you have you ever you guys <laughs> ever heard people say that black people can't be racist <laughs> oh my god i'm not gonna i'm not gonna edit that out have you ever heard people say that yes yeah, yeah I've heard heard that. i heard that numerous times yes do you agree well no because i think your mother's racist <laughs> Crystal, Crystal, I'll edit it out. Don't worry. I no, no, not, no, 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 yeah. no, 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 of racism was having the ability to control the uh basically the success and the trajectory and the the welfare the impact over another race based off yeah. of the belief that your race is superior so there used to be a time when the definition said that so okay. could black people be racist off of that stance alone no no yeah can you, re can, can you repeat that again the definition of racism was was defined and I would have to find like the exact year. I've I've looked for it before, um, mm -hmm. but I don't know that Webster keeps a online database of what the definitions used to be. Okay. Um, but Webster used to define racism as the ability to control the the having influence and control over the success and welfare of another race of people um, based. Uh, exclusively based off of their race you know what i'm saying like i'm keeping these people down because they are these people black people can't do that we don't have the ability what's the what's the um what's the definition now the definition now is very close to what prejudice is you believe that your race is superior based they the the the, the delineation between prejudice and racism now is that prejudice is all inclusive I am so so based on Webster. So so Merriam Webster. I'm prejudging pre somebody because of their parents. Well, I'm so, not just prejudging. I believe my I believe I am superior to you, be based off of. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So uh, Merriam Webster dictionary says racism is a belief that race is a fundamental uh, detriment 
of human traits and cap capacities and that racial differences produce an inherent superiority of a particular race. That definition, that definition lines up with Crystal's mother being racist. <laughs> But do I feel I don't I don't but see I don't I don't feel like that's a seven for the listen, all, 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 I, also I, I, behavior or attitudes that reflect I do not and need disbelief listen, listen, racial listen. discrimination or prejudice. <laughs> listen, listen, microaggressions. I, lo I, lo I love I love Carol Ann Mack, <laughs> who is Chris's Wait. mother. I love her. Okay. And and and, and I love her. And, and if she sees this, I want her to know, Carolyn, Miss Carolyn, I love you. But you are racist. Wait, and hold on. Definition, <laughs> definition two a. Wait, definition two a says it's so the systemic, bad. the systemic so oppression of a racial group to the social, economic, and political advantage of another. It's there it is. So that is that is the that is what the definition used to be. Mm -hmm. Used to be. Okay. It used to be yeah. that. So it says. Um, Yep. See, it says, and this is this is according to the Atlantic. It says, since the 1960s, racism has often been used in terms such as societal racism and institutional racism, referring to structures of society that disadvantage people uh, of subordinate races because of the collective effect of bigoted attitudes. So that was. The I mean, I think I, I think that could still be true. What do you mean? I mean, we have affirmative action in the eye to help us. The, yeah, but I think diminish that, but I think there's multiple ways people can be racist. So right, but yeah. what I'm, and, and see that's the thing. I think we have to be very careful because we have now. I think personally, I think racism has been watered down to make yeah. it so that anybody can be racist. Right, so that exclusively one race is not singled out as the only ones capable of being so hateful. This is a term, and I, I feel like that's a part of without getting into a real uh revolutionary situation here i feel like this is a part of <laughs> watering down watering down the impact oh, yeah. the societal and the historical impact that has what is done Q to black people qep yeah what is Q done to black people i honestly feel like i know fred I mean, hampton fred hampton i mean that. qep Maybe. people we they right. I'm seriously the definition had to be watered down so that oh I can't be I can't be the only one that's this mean everybody's this mean no yeah just yeah. just accept it like this is if institutional and societal racism are exclusively constructs and 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 in situations that only white people can influence then what is the you can't argue. You can't argue, oh, just get over it. Oh, anybody can get to it. You can't mm -hmm. argue that anymore. Because it's like, no, you are the actual architects of the most impactful and damaging social construct to black and brown people ever. You're the architects and the and the and the and the, the CEOs and the designers of it. And we'll never be able to accomplish that as long as it currently exists in its current state. Now, can we be prejudiced? Yes. Can we be bigoted? Of course. That can't be, there's no debate on that. But racist. And, with, mm, <laughs> and uh -oh. with that being and with that being said. Thank y'all for rocking with us on another episode of Five Things Off the Wall. If you have not subscribed or liked our channel, you can find us everywhere, all platforms. YouTube, if you want to see our lovely faces, our bubbly personalities, please subscribe. Appreciate you. In everything you do, take positivity with you. Peace. Yeah. Happy birthday, Elias. Happy birthday, E. E money. Peace, beautiful people. It's your boy, Dad. Listen, man, follow, like, subscribe, Five Things Off the Wall. We are available on YouTube and IG. Five Things Off the Wall. 5-T-O-T-W. Peace.